Hey everybody, I'm super stoked. I just got a buck down on the ground. It's a six pointer. We've been having this guy on the trail camera. I'll roll in some footage, but super, super excited. With my 10 point crossbow, 55 yard shot. I've been seeing this guy and where I'm hunting is a super secret spot, bow only zone. I've seen this guy with my eyeballs the past three days in a row and we couldn't get a shot on them. Kids said they didn't want to hunt today. I said, well, I'm getting out in the woods, 55 yards. So I set up tonight closer to the trail he was going on, but he still didn't go down that trail. I've seen him on three days in a row. He was out further. So at 55 yards, I gave him the old meh. He stopped and looked at me and I squeezed the trigger on the 10 point. I'll show you my crossbow here in a little bit. I just now uh, tracked this guy. He went about ooh, 80 yards in a circle, but 55 yards was my guesstimate. I hadn't ranged that spot because I didn't expect him to be out that far, but I gave him the old meh, looked up at me and I used the, I aimed between the 50 yard dot and the 60 yard arrowhead. I'll pop up the reticle right here, what it looks like, but Super, super stoked. I'll uh, I'll show you this buck here in a minute. But um, this is my first deer with my new 10-point crossbow. Super, super stoked. First buck I have ever taken with a crossbow. But, hey, 55 yards, that thing's a laser. Just as soon as I uh, squeezed the trigger, I heard that. I knew I hit him. I found the blood trail uh, and then followed him up here. I'll show you the shot here. Hit a little bit further back than I wanted to, but it did the job. Smoked this Middle Tennessee buck. We're allowed two bucks, so now I gotta save my save my second buck, maybe for a little bit bigger one. Uh, but I'm super super excited. Like I said, had this one on camera. This is the first buck I've ever taken to have on camera and then get the deer. Everybody wants to see the rack, right? <clears throat> so, we'll call this the the private land six pointer. But, uh, long story short on this one, I found out who the landowner was, gave him a phone call, asked him, hey, would you mind if we hunted on your property? And he said, no, have at it. Uh, so, this is one of the guys we've had on camera and we've been after him. Really cool to see him and pattern him. Like I said, three days in a row I've seen this deer. Day number four, he comes down the same path and we put the slock on him at 55 yards with that crossbow. Uh, but, like I said, uh, those crossbows nowadays, they are like lasers. I'd practiced out to 60 yards, so I was 100% confident when I squeeze the trigger off, but man, beautiful, beautiful deer. We're gonna take him to the processor, uh, either tonight or in the morning, but I couldn't be more excited. Let me uh, flip this camera around and I'll show you this deer a little bit more. He was looking at me this way. There's the entrance a little bit further back than where I would have wanted it to hit. So I did hit a little bit of the guts in there. <clears throat> and then, a full pass through on the other side there so and like I said he went about 80 yards but super super excited six point on private I'm tickled to death and we got him on camera so super super excited while I'm taking care of this dude let me show you in some of the trail camera footage I have of this buck at least I think it's the same buck We'll see here in a second. I've got to review it myself. Check out this camera footage from a trail camera. Here's another video of this deer. This is at seven o'clock in the morning on a completely different day. So he was not going too far. He was showing up in the morning and in the evenings, but I saw him mostly in the evenings here, but love having the trail camera footage of him. Here's another video of him coming into the camera straight on. This, this video, this angle makes him look bigger when he's up looking at you like that, but 
Beautiful deer. I love checking the trail cam videos, but that's that buck right there walking right in front of the camera. Pretty cool to see him on the cameras. That is 100% the same buck you can tell from his antlers there, but this is one of the first times that we saw him. This was at 5 o'clock p.m., which is about the exact same time I was seeing him every day. That's definitely the same deer. Here's another video of that buck. This one was at 4 o'clock in the morning. So good to see him, but not as good to see him in the nighttime. But that's that same buck again at 4 o'clock in the morning on a different day. Here's some video of some of his ladies. I love watching the deer, even if it's does. This was that same day as that nighttime one, but pretty looking deer there. All right, so we got him drug up a little bit here in the light here, but this is my 10 point Viper S400. And I'll show you the broadheads we're using. Those are the broadheads that did the trick there. Like I said, 55 yard shot, no problem. Heard the arrow hit him and then he only went about 80 yards or so in a circle, but probably about 30 yards in a straight line. But cannot tell you how excited I am to have this Tennessee buck down. Super, super tickled. Super, super excited. You guys that know me uh, closely, I have not taken a buck bigger than a spike in over 10 years. Uh, so this deer absolutely was one of the ones we were after. And I'm super, super excited that it all came together. We've been working on this guy for quite some time. Man, I'm so excited. I'm literally speechless. I don't know what to say, but super, super excited. Crossbow got it done. 55 yard shot. That's further than most of my deer with muzzle loaders and rifles. Uh, but these 10 point crossbows, absolutely amazing. And they do the trick. They do the trick. What do you think about that deer? It's cool. That's a big one, huh? We've been seeing that guy in the woods and on the camera, haven't we? Mm -hmm. Here, can you hold his head up real big? Hold it up real heavy. <coughs> oh, man. That's a big one, isn't it? <coughs> Should we put him on the wall? Uh -huh. So we can see him all the time mm -hmm. with our other deers? Now we need to go get some more big deer, don't we? Uh-huh. Yeah, I know where some bigger ones are. <laughs> White tails will we have on the wall. We want as many white tails on the wall as we can get, man. I want 300 of them. If we, all the all the big animals go on the wall, the tiny boys will have to eat. I said the tiny boys we have to eat them. The tiny the baby boys we have to eat the meat, but the big boys we have to put on the wall. Yeah, and this one we got him with the crossbow. That crossbow worked good, didn't it? Pretty sweet. Appreciate y'all watching. I'm super excited. Make sure you subscribe for more videos like this. Appreciate y'all watching. We'll see y'all on the next one. Woohoo!